Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of the Frenchie Bastille channel. Today we're exploring the option of custom seat backs. Uh, I acquired this car already ordered with option and spec. I was unable to um, secure an allocation whereby you can tailor the car through the Porsche exclusive manufacturer. Uh, otherwise known as CXX option. Uh, there is an option to get the Pepita uh, Houndstooth uh, seat inserts. They do come in three different shades. And uh, that's something that was really hoping to get a car uh, with those. I'll show you a picture of those uh, later on in the video. They're, they're pretty awesome. They're retro. And they just give that, that bit of style where the, where the cabin is mostly black. It does have a nice stripe in the dot twos. A nice red racing stripe to go with uh, red red belts and red deviated stitching. Uh, leather package as well as on the dash and the doors and the, um, the door panels. It's very nice, very nice. But my buddy told me, who is a Porsche mechanic at a dealer, uh, he told me that these seat inserts, actually, they come right out. Um, I don't know if that's true, but we're going to find out. I'm going to try it here for the first time and see if that's that's true. So let's dig in there. I'm not going to use any tools. Let's dig in there. I hear Velcro. Looks like it's coming out. Huh, look at that coming out. Look at that. Look at that. The seat back came out just like that. That's amazing. Look at that. GT3. Almost looks like a little a little surfboard. <laughs> so that's cool. All right. Yeah, my buddy told me that this could be easily reupholstered or switched out. Keep the originals. Interesting. Okay. How about the bottoms? The bottoms? Yeah. Looks like they do. Looks like they come right out. Get in there. Oh, the bottom's much stickier. Let's see. Well, it's got a big old Velcro on the bottom. Big old Velcro flap on the bottom one. Look at that. Yeah, there you go. You got carbon fiber, just a straight bucket. Straight bucket. And these seats, these seats aren't, aren't really for a big, large people, I would say. I'm six foot one, 195 pounds. Um, I fit just fine in them. I, I have headroom. I've got uh, plenty of leg room, plenty of leg room, um, about an inch space on my hips in these buckets. 18-way uh, adjustable, four-way adjustables are also very comfortable. They just don't have that you know, extreme high side bolster or the, um, the harness holes. But yeah, this is pretty interesting. There's also a vendor um, who can sell aftermarket Pepita seats. And they're going for a little bit under three grand delivered. So why don't you comment below if you think it's worth it. Should I take these out and put in the Pepita seats? Keep these uh, keep these stock mint in the box while I um, beat up on those Pepita seats? Yeah, let me know your thoughts. Be sure to like, comment, and share. And be sure to subscribe.